Well, you know, today's going to be a good day when you're rolling coal and you're on your way to Fat Bob's RV and trailer sales. I brought my custom hauling rig. This just got done fully custom. This was 150K. I think it was like 175 for how much this thing costs. 175,000 to get this thing fully custom. Air ride, air brakes, plush leather interior. And there's just so much. I'll, I'll break down this truck, but we made it to Fat Bob's here. It was a bit of a drive. I, hopefully he's working today. I'm actually, I've been eyeing this here. I'll just, is there a place to park this big thing? All right, I'll just jump out right here, but I've been eyeing this up online for a while. It's a triple axle. It would be perfect for the Freightliner. This, can, this thing can haul anything. And uh, this this is a big, big boy right here. What? Oh, there comes a salesman right now. You don't look like Fat Bob. Hello, sir. I am not Fat Bob. That is, is my father. Okay. Is he working today? Uh, he's not working today, but he's taught me everything he knows. So I'll be able to help you if you are okay with that. Yeah. Back in, uh, what was it? Back in 91, he sold me my first ever RV. So... I, don't, I just haven't talked to him in a while. And uh, anyway, so you're you're Fat Bob Jr., I guess? Yes, you can call me that. That's that's All my right. nickname in high school. <laughs> All right. Very good. So I have, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm looking for a camper, honestly. I came here. I got a wad of cash, ready to spend it. And I've been eyeing up a few of your big boys here, triple axle. All right. All right. We can definitely look at the campers. Now, would you consider also checking out the RVs? We do have quite a few new ones that are coming. And I see you do have a pretty nice truck with you. Yeah, but. yeah, yeah. You're asking me if I want to look at the RVs, and I brought this behemoth right here. Heck no, man. Now, this is okay, a semi-conversion into a pickup, air ride suspension, off-road tires even in case we ever get stuck. The dual smokestacks in the back, baby. Okay, okay. I, this thing is beautiful. Don't get me wrong. Okay. However, what if I could tell you that there are Freightliner M2s with cabins built right into the body? Zip it. Zip it. You're offending me, sir. The built Fat right Bob into Jr., the body. your dad, Fat Bob, would not be doing this right now. He would he would say, Okay, yep, I see your beautiful truck. We're gonna get you a, we're gonna get you a trailer. We ain't gonna get you an R V. So quit selling me on the R V, Fat Bob Jr. All right, all right. So are you looking for a fifth wheel, a hybrid, pop up trailer? What what are you thinking? W what are you thinking? Look at this thing. Well, she needs something heavy to weigh her down. You hear? All right. Fifth wheel it is. No worries. We got lots of those in stock. Uh, now, did you look at our catalog before coming? I did. I did. I'm eyeing up uh, I'm eyeing up this this slide out here, the triple axle. Then there's another one inside. I don't like the color, but maybe you guys could do something with that. Yes, we can customize these quite a bit. Uh, I can obviously pull up the brochures for you. But yeah, so this is one of our newer models. This is the EQM Homes model. Now, this is a 2022, so it will be a little bit more pricey but it also means all of your luxury amenities are built in. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, yeah, I see you got a Cummins generator in the front there, roof access, and the slide outs. How far do these slide out? So these slide out to around five feet. Uh, okay. I believe the back one is a six footer. Six -footer. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's good. That's pretty industry standard. That's not blowing away my socks or anything, all right? But uh, no, I, I love this because it's got the air right suspension. It's got the air or high electric over hydraulic brakes, so in case we're we got a heavy load, we got you know my wife's back there, and uh, and we're going across the country. You know she's a you know she's kind of like Fat Bob, I guess. But anyway, 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 that way we can slow down heavy load, because uh, this thing's what's the weight on this is how oh, what was it? It was twenty five. 20,000? It was 22,000. 22? So pretty Dang. close. Yeah, that's heavy. And and that extra weight is due to those bigger slide outs. So it's a, okay. something that your truck could definitely yeah. handle, though. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I wouldn't yeah. be too worried. But obviously, if it's a windy day, you will be feeling it feeling it down the highway. For sure, for sure. And it's uh, it's a 40 footer, 42? Uh, yeah, this is, I believe, 42 or 43. Okay. I'll have to check that one out again. We just got this in. So a little new yeah, to yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure. Let's go. Let's keep looking around a little bit. I'm, that's my that's my top priority. But you know, kind of show me around so we, see what you and uh Fat Bob got going. This is the one. Yes, Grizzly Creek. Okay. Yes. So this is the other one I was looking at. Blue. A little too much blue. Maybe if maybe if it was black and then the blue accents, I could do so it. We, but we have one of those at our other locations, just a few miles away. So we could definitely get one of those. Uh, but again, we can call a custom job if need be. Nice. Now this thing is the it's a toy hauler. Yes, it's a toy hauler. It's our top seller. Uh, it's very well made. You've definitely heard of them before. For sure. Uh, now, however, it does cost a little bit extra uh, just because this one specifically has max upgrades. However, it will be cheaper than that 
QM we first checked out? Well, let's go. Uh, yeah, these these are my two for sure. I, I haven't been here in a while. Fat Bob's made. Uh, this is a whole new outbuilding you got. That, how yes. many how many dealership showrooms do you have, man? So we have three right now on this lot. We've definitely been expanding, and it, as I said. This is not our only location. So Okay. Yeah, and I see you've been, been getting well. crazy with these truck camper conversions. These are yes, getting pretty popular. Yeah. They've been very popular. It's quite surprising, actually. But yeah, people love them. They drive like normal pickup wood, but you have all those luxury amenities and can sleep on the road. Nice, nice. So here's a Fleetwood. This is F4. Or this is uh, in the E450. Dang. Okay, yes. you got... Oh, look at this. I old think, plastic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think Fat Bob, this was one of his... Like, this is when I came in. This, these were kind of stuffs he was selling. So, very cool. Yeah, we've had this one for quite a while. Uh, this one's actually not even for sale. It's just to show... That's where Fat Bob... He, he, I'm pretty sure he li when he first opened this dealership, he slept in there for the first few years, right? He did. He did. Very cool. You are correct. Yeah, no, it's it's beautiful. Uh, we are able to order those, but they are a bit hard to get, and I don't think that's quite what you're interested in. This is what I wanted to show you, though. Yeah, no, that's pretty start. cool. Uh, I, I do appreciate it, uh, but no, I, I just got that truck fully done, getting it ready for... Honestly, I, I'm just here to buy the camper and pull her out. All right, fair enough. Uh, and this is just fun to look at, but... Oh, dude, that's is, sick. That is yeah. sick. You guys ever yeah, do like has, a military truck camper conversion? We have actually. Uh, just we finished one around two months ago. Okay, okay, and that's the pretty. Was really happy. Yeah, I've seen a lot of those. Okay, you got um, plugins for the RVs, and you guys have electric Teslas or something. Oh uh, yeah, so th this is for like people who come with electric bikes and everything. Okay. So that's what that's for. That's why they're a bit closer together than. Your typical chargers are very cool well why don't i i'm gonna go ahead let's get hooked up to this trailer uh let's go pull i want to see how it pulls see how it rides everything make sure all, all the make sure everything's working and then if i like it i'll probably go with it otherwise i'll go hook up to the other one okay yeah we can definitely uh have you test drive these now the only thing is i'll need to fill out some quick paperwork no i'm in the system fat bob knows me uh come on fat bob jr i told you man fat bob wouldn't your your, your dad wouldn't be treating me this way Okay, uh, here, yeah, just back up. I'm just gonna send yep. my little quick text. Just get me hooked up here. Yep, yeah, keep on going a little further. Slow down, slow down. There you go, perfect. All and right. then make sure to bring all the slides in. Yeah, you got the electrical connected and everything. That looks good. What I need to do is, uh, yeah, that looks pretty good. You see those slide in nice and smoothly. Oh, yeah. Everything's working great. Yeah, everything looks to be good. I know those rails are really heavy duty and, uh, you know, so, some different brands. That's why I'm going after this one. It's luxury. Those rails, sometimes on the cheaper models, they break. You are correct. But these ones are the best in class. You shouldn't have any issues. All right. Watch out. I'm uh, getting used to this thing. What do you say? It's 40, 42 footer? It is. I actually checked the paper. It's 43 foot. So okay. the biggest we got on the lot. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to have to swing pretty wide here. To yeah. Pull out. Be careful with that thing. But let me know how it goes. Yeah, you guys need to make this. This is a kind of tough turn, man. Yeah. Our apologies. We're trying to buy the land across to expand but they're being a bit painful okay no i understand i understand let's uh i'm gonna run down the interstate i'll, I'll be back in a few minutes okay sounds good see you soon so this pulls uh not too bad i i, I the weight's back there of course it's 20 i think you said twenty three thousand empty by the time i mean you're gonna put another probably two thousand in it between just all the food and probably more than that and if the gray water tank is full and just we have fresh water on board and a few other things, we're going to add quite a few more thousand pounds. But it's it's not too bad here. Let's hammer down, see if we can get up to speed here. And she's cruising down the highway just fine. That's awesome. This looks good. The only thing I'm a little worried about is I'm rolling coal right into the front of into the front of the trailer. And I like like the mountain logo and the trees. I feel like... I'm going to get it very black. Maybe that's just something I got to do. I love my stacks up there. And so maybe I just got to clean it after every, you know, week or so. But the soot, the diesel soot and all that is going to get on there. Hey, that's the price you pay. Here we go. She looks good. I stop really good. The brakes are solid. And my engine brake on this is super solid too. So I, I, I mean, this truck is built like a beast. Now I would almost be worried hauling it with like a one ton or something. I mean, I, I like would an F450 be able to? It probably would the newer ones, but I mean, this is a big trailer, so I'm glad I got what I got. I should be able to haul it just fine. There he is. He's on a four wheeler, just like his old man, Fat Bob. All right, let's pull in here. Or where do you want me to park, Garrett? I uh, can park just kind of like where we started, or you can go this way. Okay. By the chargers, that would work. There you go. 
Well, I like her a lot. Yeah, you like her? Yep. I think she's a keeper. What do you got it listed for? So this one, as I said, it's going to be a pretty penny. This one costs $400,000, which is the most expensive trailer we've okay. ever had. Yes, correct. Okay. I did not typically, see that online. Yes, typically our RVs are more in that price range, but since this is a 2022 and has all the upgrades, and again, it's going to last you for many, many years. Uh, it, has, it should have a high resale if you do want to trade in down the road or anything. Uh, and one thing I will note is this quad that I was just riding, we'll throw that in with it. Okay. Oh, well, okay. That does sweeten the deal a little bit. Uh Okay, 400k. Could we do could we do anything on that? I understand it's nice. Yeah, I like it a lot, but these are pricey for us too, you know, man. Um, okay, well, you are a returning customer. I did speak with my father when you Yeah, yeah. Were what do you say? He remembered me. But old he, fat Bob would did, give me a deal. He he did remember you. He did remember you. Uh he said you were a little bit of a picky customer in okay, the past. Okay. So, but today you've been very good. Uh I'm gonna say we should be able to knock it down to 380. 350, and I'm walking out of here shaking hands. I got a wad of cash in the back seat. I can do 375. I only have 360. Ah, uh, I don't know. It's if a few suitcases full. A few suitcases. Sure, you can carry it? Man, do you want the quad with that? Because I can't do it at that price. 365 in the quad. Let's do it. Shake on it. Okay, you know what? Will it give us a good word and a good review on Google? Yes, sir. Yep, shake All on right, it. Let's shake good, on it. Good American. There you go. All right, open these back doors. A bunch of money's gonna come flying out. You just gotta get your shovel and wheelbarrow. All right, I will grab one of those, and we can deliver the Can Am to your house if you would like. Okay. Yep. That that would be that would be best. But let's go in and we'll do the paperwork and get all that squared away. And I'm gonna get out of here. Yep. Sounds good. Finally, can get you signing something. That's right. All right, so we decided on, it was what, 365? Yep, 365, four-wheeler with it, and uh, yep, everything looks good there. Perfect. All right, just sign the bottom of the page, and it should be good to go. Perfect. Got my handy-dandy pen here. Perfect. All right. Oh, that's a nice pen. Yep, that looks good, Garrett. I, uh, I'm excited, man. Jump in for joy. I'm going to head out of here, tell Fat Bob I said hello, and and uh, place is looking good. Thank you, thank you. He will be very happy to hear that. And if you ever want to buy another RV, just come back here. You know where we are. Well, I shouldn't. Hopefully, I don't need another one. But uh, yeah, if we have any breakdowns or anything, for sure. Oh, that that will be good. But hey, man, if you ever want like an RV instead of just a trailer, we got you covered. All right. See you later, Fat Bob Jr. See you later. Well, there we go, guys. We got the camper. I think. My plan was to at least have a camp here by this weekend because we were going camping this weekend. But I got it here pretty early, which is awesome. And uh, I'll kind of get breaking it in, figuring out everything and how everything works. But there we go. I think I look pretty good driving this. Hope you guys enjoyed. Smash like button if you haven't already. Subscribe as well. And I'll see you in the next one.